Hello everyone! Today I have a little bit exciting haul for you because it's I have two some two items which are not makeup related uh, and rest of is makeup. But we're gonna start with non-makeup related products. So the first one is my Quest bag. It looks like this. And has like this long, and you have like two different sections, which is really really nice. They're quite big. This, I'm so excited! It's gonna be perfect for the summer to just can have everything in it here. So I'm really excited with this. So the second one is a little bit bigger bag and this one is like this, you know, a bit like this. It's like this dark grey color. It's uh, Donna Karan, New York and it's really really big. You get lots and lots of space in it. I'm so excited to use it. I'm so happy with this. So yeah, these were my two non-makeup products. And before I jump in the real haul, uh, I want to say that everything that I show you, I have purchased with my own money. I haven't got anything sent, just so you know. But let's just jump in. So, the first thing I'm going to show you are foundations. I have three foundations. One is what's this called Maybelline Fit Me Luminous Plus Smooth uh, Normal to Luminous Plus Smooth Foundation looks like this uh, it has a pump so which is really nice it's the lighter shade they have I'm not gonna swatch foundations but I'm really excited to try this and also I have two Estee Lauder double wear I have two different shades one is Fresco, which is a little bit darker, and the second one is Ecru, I think. Uh, I'm going to show you like this. So, um, Ecru is a little bit lighter, so I can see which one suits me better. Then, then I got some a small primer from Makeup Forever. This is mattifying, so I noticed that in the spring summertime I get a little bit oily on my D zone no most oiliest is on my forehead so I'm gonna be really excited this is a small um, sample size looks like this it's like 50 mils I actually don't need that much so it's really exciting then I also got this um, Brevity Last Nourish eyelash conditioner uh, looks like this um, also really excited to try out because I've heard that it helps to grow your eyelashes so I want to have longer lashes so the actual product looks like this it has a little wand on top of it I don't know if you can see so you just but after you take off your makeup and uh, try it out, then you can put this uh, on your lash, uh, lash line. So after in time, like maybe, what is this? After two, three weeks, it should be showing uh, your lash growth. So I hope it works. Then, what else, what else? Then, let's just jump in some face products. I got this Benefit Feeling Tandy um, kit. Looks like this. I don't know if you can see it. Yes, like this. The back side, it looks like this. It reflects my lights reflecting. But it's evening and I came from work. <laughs> and all this packaging. So let's just jump in and open this. So, it comes like 
like this you have like blush lip color and uh, liquid blush and uh, highlighter in here uh, you get Posey Tint, High Beam, Land Delicious uh, Blush and Lip Gloss. So it, this is going to be also really interesting to try out. I haven't tried anything from Benefit before. I don't think so. And then you also get these sheets in here which show you what to use, how to use, how to apply. So I'm really, really excited to try this out. The next thing is by Marc Jacobs, Shameless Bold Blush in the shade Naughty 202. So the packaging looks like this, really nice packaging. So the product comes in like this pouch, little bag, and you open it and you get a small brush and a blush so let's see how it looks looks like this and let's just swatch it feels nice you can see the color is over there so I'm gonna just add here Oh, this is really, really sheer color, so it's really hard to see. Uh, this is really, really sheer color. Uh, I don't know if you can see, it should be like here. But I think it's really, it's so sheer that it's almost like a highlighter, if you can say. It's so sheer um, in color. So I'm also really excited. To try out this one, it looks so fancy and I like the packaging, it's so nice packaging, like a little back. Really, really nice. And I like the pouch actually, this little bag it came in. Really, really fancy. So the next thing is also from Marc Jacobs and this is the nudie, Nudist Kit. And this looks like this. You get this uh, mirror, you get the eyeliner, and you get the small lipstick. So let's just open this up. So here is the Marc Jacobs eyeliner. Here is the lip color and this role play. Let's see how this looks. It's a really small lipstick. <laughs> But it feels nice. It feels really nice. Looks like this. So the lipstick is really it is nice to have this small lipstick, especially when it's so such a nice nude color. Um the lipstick looks like this. And let's just watch the eyeliner. Oh it feels really really good. Oh it feels good. I'm really really happy and you also get this little pouch with uh, with um oh with a mirror inside I'm not gonna show you the mirror because it feels a little bit blinding uh, I think so, but this is also nice to have it in your handbag so then I have this MAC mineralized skin finish in warm rose this looks like this let's just swatch it this is also really really pale color I don't know if you can see it's in next to the lip lipstick. Oh, you can't see it probably. But really excited to try this out also. So let's 
So I'm gonna just take off everything. Then the next thing is from Chanel. I've been dying to get my hands on it. And this is the Dan Soleil Tandis Chanel bronzing makeup base. The packaging looks like this, really elegant, really classy. And the actual product looks like this. And you get, it's a pretty big amount. It's 30 mils and the product looks like this. It's a cream product, uh, so you can use it alone to bronze up your face and neck or you can use it with or you can use it with other products uh, with your makeup or like this then I got also Giorgio Armani Last and Silk UV Compact Foundation this is a refill product um, you get this little sponge with it and the actual product looks in here and you can deep it with your whatever you need and the product looks like this it's like a face powder if you can say so it looks really nice um, so I'm really excited to try this out because I haven't tried anything from Giorgio Armani. I forgot to say the shade. I have 3.5 shade. And it has SPF 34 and PA++++. So, really, really nice. Then, I have something from Becca. My first Becca purchase. And this is a kit which has Shimmer Skin Perfector Pressed Opal mineral blush in flower shell shimmering skin perfecto spotlight wand moonstone and backlight priming filter so you get four products in one kit they are small but i think it's better to buy a kit to try out products before you go out and buy full size products so for me it's really really exciting to try out backup products because here in Sweden, it's really it's difficult to get your hands on Becca products. You have to search and they are not really cheap either. So this is the Becca Shimmer Skin Perfector in Moonlight. This looks like this. They are quite small, I will say. They are really, really small. If you can look, they are, they are really small. But to try out products, and actually, how often do you use a, a full-size product? Oh, I'm definitely gonna love the Moonstone. Oh, this looks fabulous. I don't know if you can see. Oh yeah, you can see that. It's amazing. Definitely really, really excited to try this out. Then we have this backlight priming filter. We'll see how this is. Oh, I think I got too much. It has a pump, which is really, really nice. So this is like a primer. Oh, you can definitely see the light. You see, this is a moonstone and this is the primer. So it is really heavy reflecting because if I compare it with the L'Oreal Lumin Magic then this this is a heavy duty glow I would say so I would say that if you're not used to it such glow uh, be careful because I'm definitely I'm not used to having such glow so I'm gonna be definitely careful but let me see this is a Becca Shimmer Skin Perfector in Opal. Oh. It's so cute. Look at this. I don't know if you can see. But I'm gonna swatch it also. Oh. 
Oh, this is a heavy duty, definitely. This is a glow. Uh, you can see, you can see this. It's a beautiful shade. It's more. It's really. I don't know. It has. It is beautiful. It has like really high shimmer in it. Amazing, amazing. Definitely, I'm gonna buy more makeup products. And the second thingy, fourth thing actually, is Becca Mineral Blush in Flower Child. This looks like this. Looks like also really nice. And the feel of it. Oh. Oh, this is a really nice blush. Oh my god. This is a. Can you see it? It's such a beautiful blush. Such a beautiful blush. Definitely must have in the summertime. Now I understand why people rave about Becca products because honestly they are good. They are good. So then I have some lip products here. Uh, I got uh, from Sephora. I got. Oh, right. I forgot to mention that some of the products are from Sephora, some of them are from other online sh beauty stores. So I got this lip gloss set from Sephora. So let me see if I can open it. Got what is this? One, two, three, four. Oh, that's a that's a. I didn't know that you get like four different shades of lip glosses, and they all have this small one. So that's a cool thing. Let's swatch. You get two, which one is like more red with shimmer, one is like matte pink, one is pink shimmer and the last one is like really nude, nude color. So that's a nice one. So the swatches are here. Maybe I hold this. So they go like maybe this side the other side. I hope you can see. So that's a nice one but it's difficult if you're traveling then you don't want to maybe take all of them with you because you maybe don't like all the shades because one of them, two of them are not shimmering but two of them are shimmering. But it's a nice one also to try out so really really exciting oh my god I'm so excited with all these products so oh so next thing is Yves Saint Laurent uh, what's this Rouge Pour Couture Glossy Stain in the shade 12 Coral Coral V whatever my French is not good and this looks like uh, this this is a peachy color and this is a stain so if you use it be careful with this but it's a beautiful summer color I'm definitely loving this nice 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 really nice to use in the summer and as you know it's really hard to get off stains next thing is Chanel Rouge Coco Shine Hydrating Sheer Lip Shine fifth, number 54 boy I've heard people 
rave about this because they say it's some so nice shade, it's so nice. And when I was swatching there, I kind of felt that it's too shiny, but as a everyday lipstick, I think it's gonna be good. So let's just swatch it here. Yeah, it's really it's really shiny and it's a sheer. So the color looks like this. It's like this nude pink color. So definitely happy with this. Uh, the next thing is MAC Satin Lipstick in the shade Fox. Oh, this is also a really nice color. If you can look, the Chanel is uh, from the left and the right one is MAC Fox. That's a nice color also and uh, really nice. I got free gift from uh, Sephora. This is a NARS Beauty Insider Lip Kit. So you have velvet matte lip pencils too. Oh no, one is velvet matte lip pencil and the second one is satin lip pencil. So the packaging looks like this. That's a nice one because I haven't tried anything from NARS before. Anything at all. And so the pencils are like this. They're small ones but how often do you go through all of them? So that's a nice color. This isn't the color... Um, Hmm, it doesn't say what color it is. That's a strange. Okay, I can't tell you the color. Maybe I can search which color it is, but it doesn't say it here, unfortunately. Uh, but anyhow, this is more like this mauve pink color. It looks like this. And the second one is like matte deep red color and this looks like this so here are the swatches they look nice uh, so what else did I got? And then I have some samples here. I have Donna Cara New York Be Delicious Fresh Blossom Fragrance sample. Looks like this. Then I got also Giorgio Armani C Rose Signature sample, which is also really nice because this. Georgian Money, how do you, do you see? Because the Georgian Money C perfume, I didn't like the scent, but this is like rose signature, so I hope this is maybe more florid tone. Then I got Dior, Dior Show Maximizer 3D Backstage Pros Triple One Plumping Lash Primer. This looks like this. Claims all the fancy, fancy, fancy stuff. Oh. Okay. The mount looks like this. Yeah. Small sample. Really excited to try it. Then I also got... Previch Anti-Aging Plus Intensive Repair Eye Serum and this looks like this it's so hard to show you because it's so light just like that then I got Lumina right now with Vitamin C Hyaluronic Essence hmm? this one looks like this
And then I also got Estrada Double Wear sample in outdoor beige, which is oh, which is really really dark. And this looks like this. So yeah, this was all of my this ends with my this ends my haul. Uh, I do enjoy hope you enjoy this haul because I definitely did, and I'm so excited to try out some new products, especially Becca products and some new foundations. I got lots of new products which I want to try out and. And my new bags, I'm also so excited about those. So anyhow, I hope you enjoy this and we will see you next time. Bye!